Alrighty guys, my name's KC and welcome back to some FTB Pyramid Reborn. We've been enjoying this pack and uh, I want to have a little talk, I want to have a little talk guys. Um, so things for me have been uh, a little bit hectic over the past few days. Um, but I'm hoping that starting next month, starting, what is it, we're in April aren't we? Yeah, in May, I'm going to be back full time. We're going we're gonna to have regular videos again. I apologize guys, it has been a little bit hectic and uh, I don't care what I have to do. I don't care if I have to go from, from possibly my new home all the way across my county uh, to my mother's to upload the videos. We are going to get regular content out again. Uh, and that, That's my plan for today. I'm, I'm like planning to, to record a lot of videos today. <laughs> Um, I don't really have much to do today, actually, uh, which is really good, which is really good. It's half past, no, it's not, it's quarter to 11, I thought it was half past 10. Uh, so I'm up, I'm, I'm awake and I'm early. Uh, and uh, what we, what I want to do is I want to get a set up on a couple of things. The first thing is I want the angel ring, which means we need that stonework factory, which means, oh, we need some stuff. We need some stuff, which uh, is not, it's not good, it's not good, it's not good, it's not good, it's not good. Um... I just realized I didn't actually attach anything to that range collector over there. What happened to the barrel I was supposed to attach to it or the um the cable? Why did nobody tell me about this? So let's grab you. I don't know I don't get why my computer's being a little bit laggy at the minute. Uh, it's been a little bit iffy all morning. Uh yeah. So we've got that, we've got that, and um I need a I need a crate. Okay, let's go and sort this out. And w one of the problems we're having is we need we need lava. Stop that. Stop it, game. Stop it. I do know that it is updating something in the background, but I didn't think that, that would impact this much. I may have to wait for that to do. Oh, I started moving these over here. We haven't got power to these yet. I want to sort out a better power system in the near future, but I've got enough of these items to sort of see me through for now. So let's have a little look. You're not actually picking anything up. Even though I'm getting this, I don't think that this mob grinder here actually drops stuff. I, 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 I don't. And uh, this isn't picking up because we needed a redstone torch. That was it. That was it. That was it. That was it. Okay. Uh, I'm going to cheat a little bit. I'm going to cheat a little bit. I'm not really going to cheat, but I've got, I've got wood on me. Uh, let's go ahead and make ourselves a redstone torch. And then we can go ahead and we can tell this thing to do what it needs to do, when it needs to do it. So, pulse. I do have a feeling that this does need power, even though it doesn't say it. Uh, mod mode off. This enables a filter. We'll compare the mod items from... Okay. Ignore dictionary. Respecting metadata. Okay. Um, I got a feeling that that needs power. Uh, you know what? I'm gonna I'm gonna worry about that a little bit later on. We'll just pop this here first of all, uh, and we'll say, you know what? Just take it out. Just take out from there, and do what you got to do with it. Okay. Let's get back to today's episode. Today, I want to get that stonework factory made, which does mean that we need we need some stuff. We need some stuff. I can't remember what we need, but I know it involved lava. And uh, I want to try and get. Oh no! It inc included nether brick. That was it. It included nether brick. So. Let's have a little look if we go to the stonework factory. Oh wait, did we have the stonework factory? Um, no, I, I need a lava bucket. That was it. Uh, so I needed lava. That was what we was... Yes, it was lava. Uh, which I can get from the magma crucible. Okay, but the magma crucible requires these nether brick. Okay. So that's what we're working on. We're working on the magma crucible. Magma crucible. Okay. Crucible. And uh, how much of this stuff do I have? I have that. Okay, so let's see. I need Electrum. I do not have Electrum. I could have sworn that I had some Electrum. Okay. Okay, you know what? Actually, what we want is we want an external storage bus. Let's, let's do something else first. Uh, we need this thing. Uh, which, I'm missing those three things, which is an improved processor. So we've got that, we've got that. And what was the other one for the improved processor? It was a gold. Okay. So let's just grab gold. Where's gold? I made another one of these sword words. I don't know if I actually told you about that. Uh, but I did. I did. I did. I did. I did. External. Uh, I if you spell external right. Okay. So we've got that. Pop that in there. Okay. 
that's not the external. So we've got this one made up. We've got this one, which is the basic processor and that, which I think I've got. Yep. Cool. Actually, I need three of these now I'm thinking about it, uh, which means I need one, two of those. And uh, yeah, actually, let's worry about making this first. Okay, we'll just, I uh, will make one, two will do. It doesn't really make much of a difference. Let me in there. Thank you. Come on, stop lagging on me. Okay, we've got this, and now we should have some cable. Uh, well, I've got a bunch of it. I accidentally made a bunch of it, didn't I? Okay, now this external storage is amazing. Because we can hook this up to our to our applied, to our refined. Oh, stop lagging on me. To our refined storage system. And basically hook it up to the storage drawers and allow us to access the stuff in the storage drawers. Um... Even though this is a little problematic. Um, I'll tell you what, let me get this done. Back with the email. So I've connected that to the back there. And what we're going to do is we're just going to set... This is a drop trolley, yes. We're going to set this to priority... No. Plus a thousand. Or plus two hundred. That'll do. There we go, look. And what it's going to do is it's going to say any of these items that you see here is going to be put into this draw controller before it's put into the system. But we'll be able to access them from the crafting grid. If we go over to the crafting grid, I'll show you. Uh, that we'll be able to access them. Um, but we do need to make ourselves some Electrum, which is a little problematic. It's gold and silver. It's not, not relatively expensive. We have both gold and silver by the bucket ton. If we go here now, you'll be able to see that we have all of this. So if I grab some gold and I grab some uh, silver, let's have a little, a little look. Electrum. I could have sworn that I already had some, but evidently I don't. Uh, is there like a way to make it? We could just put gold and silver in the induction furnace, so yeah, that's okay. Um, did I not put my silver in there? Maybe I didn't. Maybe I didn't. I could have sworn it. Did. Oh no, the silver didn't didn't fit. It's on it's on the other side. That's it. It's it's on a side that isn't connected to them drawers yet. Maybe I can connect them using a trim. I suppose we'll find out. So we've got our induction smelter here. Uh, we could just go ahead and put those in there, and this shouldn't take too long. We only need the one, the one ingot. Uh, but I am gonna let, I'm gonna let it do. I'm not gonna stop it because obviously it'd be good to have them. It'd be good to have them. Okay, so let's go over here and let's do this. Let's have a little look. I just hope mobs don't start spawning in there. They have a habit of doing that. Okay, so if we put this away, uh, all the stuff we don't need out. Okay, so if we go to magma crucible. Okay, we obviously we we need this which we've got. Cool. Okay, and we need some copper gears, which is easy. Uh, we need this redstone reception coil. Again, another easy machine. And we've got everything now apart from this nether brick. Now, I don't know how close we are to a nether fortress. Um, but we can get nether brick um, by putting lava onto bricks. Okay, and um, we still need to generate lava, which is my problem. I was... Just realizing that, no, we actually, we, we need, do these use, ah, these use, okay, okay, so we can get blaze powder. Blaze powder is a possibility if we look here. Uh, with glowstone dust, with redstone and fluid transposer. So, can we make ourselves a fluid transposer? So, let's, let's have a little look. Fluid transposer. Nope, that's tree fluid extractor. There we go. So, what am I missing? I'm missing the top thing. What's the top thing? A bucket. Oh, don't you just love when you're missing something so simple? So we can put this fluid transposer here. Okay. But I need to get destabilized redstone into there, which means I need the magma crucible. Do you know what I'm thinking this is? Possibly we could go and have a little look in the nether. We may find a nether fortress. We may do. Um, I do know there are a couple of other ways to make lava in the pack. Um... There is other ways to make lava. Um, we need this phosphor, which, how do we get that? Which requires that. Okay, so that's that's just not an option. Um, let's have a little look. Fluid transposer. I don't think I could just put redstone in here. I think if I put redstone in there. No. 
Okay, so let's have a little look at destabilized redstone. See if there's another way to get it. Destabilized redstone. Okay, so there's a magma crucible. And there's a centigrade thing here. And then there's a fluid transposer. But again, we need the magma crucible. Okay, let's have a little look. So we're missing the nether, nether brick. Um... And I'm not sure how to go about getting nether brick. Obviously. I mean, that, that was the option that I was going for. I mean, the other option. The other option. If we could just get one piece. Ah. I think the best option is to go and find it. Uh, actually, let's check the, the tablet. Um, let's check the tablet. And see if you're offering anything. That could help. That could potentially help. No. But, let's grab a... Oh, no, I wanted to provide you there. Okay, let's grab some void crystals. Because if we look here, we can see that there was a void crystal trade. Void crystal. I got void crystal. Or is this what it wants me to have for this? Or is this what it will give me in exchange for that? Out of item to sell. Add more to the bound inventory. Right, okay. So let's order ourselves five. Okay, order. Is that not doing anything? Oh, yeah, yep, yep, yep. There it is, look, it's happening. Okay, so it's going to take those and it's going to give us our emeralds. Maybe we can get ourselves some. Is this going to help us out any? I don't really think it will. S selling search item. Um, we will sell void crystals again because I got a ton of them. Okay. And, uh, no, void crystals. And I think that we're not supposed to do that. But at least we got some emeralds, which is something we, we didn't really need. Um, okay. Let's see if we can get lava another way. Mechanical squeezer. But again, it's getting those things. Magma crucible we've already discussed. Pyrokentic loot whoop. Um, right, fair enough, that requires that augment. Okay. Fluid transposer, which we need lava with. And getting lava is not an easy job. And getting this, this is not an easy job either, because we need one of these shimmering cores. Oh, I'm at a complete loss, I'll tell you. I suppose, I suppose it's into the nether. We just need some nether brick. <laughs> I'll catch you guys back. A little exploring in the nether, a little bit of YouTube, and I think I've come up with a solution. Uh, if we make this casing, uh, which we cannot make, let's make a couple of those. Uh, what do I need? I need Inori blocks. Do I have any Inori blocks? Yeah, cool. So if I make this casing, okay, and then the next thing I want to make is a controller, which is this thing. This is a lava fabric, uh, fabric controller. Uh, we're going to need a few things for that. Okay, so we need the iron casing, which I, I just realized that I did actually have. Um, nope, don't have enough of those. Um, okay, do I have... Nope. Okay, that's not a problem. Let's go and grab them. What are the other things that we need? What are these? 
annoy blocks. Okay, so we've got a few annoy blocks. Okay, so let's grab those. I think it's just the redstone that I need. The redstone blocks. We've got those, so we need... Yes. Yes. Okay. Am I sure that I don't have any of those? I mean, okay. Fair enough, fair enough. If, if, if you say so, game, if you say so. I probably lost them somewhere, but I'm sure that I had some. I'm sure I made more than I needed of those. But that's okay. Let's let's get this done. Let's get this done. Okay, and we can just toss these on here. Cool. And we'll turn half of those into these, and we'll keep the other half as blocks. I did empty most of the chests. That's my emergency chest. Let's see an apple. We got enough of them to go around. We don't really need better food. We're good. We're good. Oh, actually... Uh, let's turn down my chunks. <laughs> I, I don't want to be overpowering this. Okay. So let's make ourselves some of those. And we'll make ourselves one. Shall we, shall we make two? The video I watched made two. Okay, the video I watched was a World's Night video, which is one of my personal favorite YouTubers. Um, but I, I'd seen it before. I just couldn't remember how he did it. Okay. So, uh, let's go over here. We're going to do this over here. Uh, let's see if I've got this this right. Okay, that's not the pathway. So, we'll do it. Um, we'll do it over here. So, we've got... Ooh. Actually, no, let's do it over here. We've got Lava Fabricator. We've got... Casing block needs to go. Oh, this is going to be a little bit problematic. I mean, I suppose we could do that and then do the lava fabric controller there and put the casings around it like so. Now, you don't need the corner casings. Uh, I don't think so, anyway. And that should make lava. Let's have a little... Okay, it can produce one. It just needs the recommended stuff. Let's grab this crafting table. Put ourselves over there. I don't think that needs, like, power or anything. Let's do another one. Sort of like here. Okay. Okay. So how many people are going to be watching the Greatest Royal Rumble? I am. Looking forward to this. It's going to be first live WWE pay-per-view in a long time. That I've actually watched live because it's always a reasonable time in England for a change. Okay, so I don't know how much this lava factory is complete and can produce lava. Okay, does it just need to... There we go. Boom. Lava. That was easy. I was making it a lot more complicated than it needed to be. Um, but at least it was easy. Let's go grab a, let's go grab ourselves a, um, bucket. Uh, I don't actually have a bucket. So let's grab two because I need one of lava and I need one of water. And, uh, yes, let's do that. And, uh, I know a lot of people use, like, the water mill for power for the angel ring, but we're going to use something a little bit different. I like using the solar panels. I just like the way they look. I think they look really lovely. And they're really nice. But I think that we'll probably get into that in the next episode. Because this episode has kind of rambled on. Quite a ways with me trying to figure out lava. <laughs> but at least we'll get this stonework factory done. I don't even know what the stonework factory does. I think it, I, my, my guess is it produces variants on, on stone. Um, so let's get this done. Stonework factory. Okay. Oh, sorry, I just knocked the mic. Okay. I just... I want to put this down and have a little look. Yes, yes. I it, You put something in here... Uh, and it, like, grinds it down, so it will grind, or it will craft it or something, and you can um, tell it what you want it to do here. This is actually a really good uh, piece of equipment. Uh, I, did, I haven't actually seen Wells use this. I've actually watched another YouTuber called System Collapse use it. Uh, it's a really, really handy piece of um, equipment. It doesn't really do anything in terms of progression for you that much, but it does help you out when it comes to just needing some building blocks and other stuff that otherwise you would require a lot of work to get. Oops, nope. These keep appearing here. These three. This quest keeps getting repeated. And repeated and repeated. <laughs> um So yeah, I don't know I don't know why. I don't know why. 
Um, but yeah, we've got the material stonework factory is now turned green, which means we have the angel ring. Um, and we need to now go ahead and make ourselves some uh, solar panels, which requires us going down a little bit of another another path. But uh, I'm sure that we can we can do it. This thing is, is really good, but unfortunately, it's not going to work just yet. But you know what? If this episode is a little bit longer, it's a little bit longer. We're doing it. We're doing it. I feel like we've only accomplished one thing in this episode. I want to accomplish more. Okay. So. If I go to panel. Yes. Okay. So I need some of this polished stone. Ooh. And I am going to need some stone brick for that. Okay. I actually thought that I needed... Oh, hang on a minute. I need one of these resonating... Uh, crystals, which I don't actually have access to, and I don't have any ender pearls. Oh, okay. Maybe we do go the water mill. But that also requires one. Hmm. I guess, I guess, I guess. Um, I guess I am going to have to do this in the next episode, unfortunately. Um, that being said, let's go see if that, that mob factory and that range collector have actually collected anything. See if we've got any mob drops because we may have a couple of ender pearls and if we do we can do it it's, it's not that big of a deal but then again i do have some bone meal so we may be able to grow some ender pearls no my guess is this just doesn't work this mob farm isn't working the way i'd like it to uh, but i'll do a better one in the in the near future um but i do have some bone meal in the pulverizer so we can potentially get one ender pearl and break that down and get a couple of things going um It sort of starts up. Okay. So let's see. Have I got any bone meal in here? No, it's actually... It is in the pulverizer. Okay, 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 okay. I mean, that's not a big deal. I mean, how much grid power does this take? Uses 32 grid power. So I need 32... What you might call it. So I, I don't think I'm going to get this done in this episode. But we can at least start it in this episode. And uh, I can show you what I'm going to be doing between episodes. Okay, so like I said, you can actually bone meal these. We've got three enderpearls. That, that might be enough. That might be enough. At least just to get the starting one done. Because 8, 16, 24. No, it's only going to give us 24. But uh, I think we will go with the water mill. Which means we need the resonator. Which is this thing. Uh, which... I have everything but the block of coal. Okay. Oh. Do I not have coal? I am sure that I have, like, coal. I'm like, I should have coal. I've definitely got coal. Maybe not. Maybe maybe it's just not available to us. Because it was in these and I'm not producing coal over there. So, yes, of course. Uh, but we got the one block. <laughs> we got the one block. Okay, so let's get this done. Let's get this done. Let's get this done. Dum 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 dum. So we need that, and we need one of these crystals, which requires an ender shard, which requires a glass cutter, which is kind of cheap. So let's do this and get ourselves two sets of ender shards. Okay, so we can make ourselves, uh, make ourselves what eight of those, I suppose. Make ourselves a resonator. Okay, now let's let's have a look at this watermill. Now I've never built this before, uh, but we need this stone bird, which is polished stone. We have a bunch of polished stone. So if we do that, we need one of these redstone gear. We do need this. I've got the resonator, but I need the um, oh, what's it called? Manual. Yes, this thing. This thing here. Okay, so if we put this resonator down, and we put this manual mill on top, and we put some polished stone inside, and we do this, it does take a little bit of a while, but as you can see, we are generating some power. We need to generate 15, and hopefully after that, that entire stack will be done. Oh, wow, it does one. Um, I'll catch you back in a bit. Well, I've got it done, and I've set it up. So we've got this sort of setup here. We've got three. They're set up like this. The water source blocks are in the corners. Uh, it doesn't look like it, but I think this one is the... Yeah, this one's the source block. And so is that one there. 
And uh, that, that's giving us enough power to fly. Uh, we're generating 14 from this one. We're generating 16 from this one and 14 from that one. So what's that? That's like 45. Is that right? That's not right, is it? That's 30. Well, that's 28, should I say. Plus 16 is 38. 40, 44, 46, something like that. Yeah, don't do math on camera. But now we can fly, which is super duper awesome. Uh, so I think that's going to do it for this episode. Let's have a little look at what we're going to work on in the next episode. Now we can actually get over here. I think in the next episode I want to do this because I would really like this energy cell. I'd also love this creator's, uh, this builder's wand here. And all we need for that is petrothium. So what what what, do, what does that need? What does that need? Actually, no, you know what? I'll save that for the next episode. Uh, we've got this to do. Yeah, uh, we, we should probably get to work on that. Actually. No, no, no. We'll, we'll save that for the next episode. Guys, that's going to do it for this episode. If you enjoyed the video, please consider leaving a like. It really helps out the channel. I really appreciate it. So please do leave a like. And click subscribe if you want to see more from me. Guys, I'm Casey. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.